It's really early in the morning on January 2nd, 2021. I'm going to have to get used to saying that because 2020 is over. That nightmare of a year is over. Now, we're starting a new age. I'm not going to like I'm not going to quit or go anywhere. I'm I'm going to be the same guy like I have been for the past 6 to 7 years. But we're going to take it slow. We're going to take it in bits and pieces. I am still going to make cooking videos. I'm still going to make reviews every now and then. Not all the time. Like, I have been, been very sporadic with them. I'm going to make a movie this year. That is my goal. My goal is to get a job. Make a movie. I have to find the actors. This is Fastest Man Ever 2, which is going to be a reboot, but also a sequel, if that makes any sense. Because I want this to be an actually good film. Not this cheesy walking around in a circle like I did the first Fastest Man Ever. It's going to be huge. It's going to be low budget. I'm very low budget at the moment, uh, but I hope to make a decent movie this year if we get to film it because there is still the mutation of the coronavirus out there and it's very deadly, dangerous, spreading all around the world. So we have to be careful. Uh, that's what I have planned. Basically last year I didn't put a lot of videos out. The only things that I remember being so good last year, a great idea actually, was the cooking series. Like, I just absolutely loved them. Every single video I did last year involving cooking, I was just, I was loving every single bit of it. Like, I was having fun. That's the point of YouTube. Now, I know my channel, uh, there is a negative side of this. Most of the views are coming from memes that I posted back in 2018, the Joey meme, that one single meme of Joey, and then uh, <laughs> Joey's World Tour cameo. And the other videos get views here and there. But that's the only negative I have about that, and I did post a few memes because I was lazy, and everybody loves memes. They walk, they get on their phone, scroll through Instagram, Reddit, whatever, look at a meme, laugh for like a minute, believing, like, like getting away from the real world. Now, that's what memes are for. I get away from the real world. I posted a few of them. Uh, it was read... Joey again, and I think a couple, uh, yeah, it was just Reed and Joey. Uh, I don't regret posting those because <laughs> a few people liked them, yeah. I want to post more original stuff, not just memes, you know. If <laughs> I find something hilarious, I will upload it. That's who I am. I just clip something, upload it for fun. Uh, yeah, but uh, I did upload a couple things I shouldn't have, like Coffin Break. I uploaded that to my other channel. If you haven't checked it out, I'll put it in the description. It's basically, I'm designing that channel to be, like, if I find something underrated, something unknown, I posted that channel. Not monetized, of course. Uh, music. Music, I mean. Like, only music-related content goes to that channel. So, uh, yeah. Uh, I, I love Jade Bird, but I do not want to post any more raw stuff on this channel because, you know, copyright and all that stuff. I'll post it to my other channel since it's, you know, if I find something, go to that channel instead. That's something I wanted to change, you know, for the longest time in 2020. Uh, 
the only thing I liked with the cooking series, which will not go away. We're just going to continue that cooking series because quarantine with the Ryan, quarantine cooking with the Ryan was successful this year. I really appreciate every single person watching this video, the videos actually, those videos. Um, what else? What else? Uh, w one more thing. I got a new guitar. I'm gonna make some more music. I just really. I'm not good at, I'm, I'm a very experimental person with my lyrics, my nonsensical, you know, lyrics and stuff. I get inspired by these grunge bands, and I never finish the songs, and, you know, it's just, it's a very hard process to uh, make music, and I got a pedal board, so we have infinite amount of effects we can test out, and you know, make guitar solos and all sorts of stuff. Now, and bass solos too, because it's a combo a combo amp. Now, there is one thing I did not like this year. Uh, it was just, you know, comments about botting and di the dislikes are just Every single video I post, like, posted this year, just get bombed by them. So, I don't care about dislikes, I don't care about likes, so I'm just gonna be, be disabling them from now on. Uh, don't call me a wimp because, you know, I disabled them. The uh, disabled them, it's my decision. I'm not going to look at the numbers anymore. The numbers are just an illusion in your mind to think something's bad or good. It's the people's and the people's mind that write comments and stuff and uh, what your vision is, you know. YouTube was to share stuff. People comment their opinion and that's it, you know. That's all my opinion on it, you know, likes, dislikes are going away from this channel. I do not care about them anymore. And, uh, turning them off, we're going to have a positive channel now. I know I've said a few negative things in the videos just as a joke or something. I'm going to try to be a positive person this year. A very positive person. I've been really, I'm being honest. I'm being honest right here. Uh, this year, this past year, um, very depressing. Uh, my mood has been swinging here and there. Not just because of the channel. It's just overall, overall my well-being. It's just, I just want to be me, okay? I didn't actually word this part of the video correctly. What I mean by I just want to be me, right? I didn't feel like myself at all this year. I mean, everyone probably can relate this year because of the coronavirus and we're all locked inside. Um, I've just been, it's been going on before 2020 even happened. It was like late 2020, like December, November. I've just, I, I'm not happy with my content and myself as a well-being. Uh, I've been going from enthusiastic, happy, and that kind of stupid humor and dramatic and all that stuff that I used to do in the past on the channel. Uh, I still do it, but I just didn't feel like uh, at myself at all. Uh, just, uh, you go from that kind of mood to depression and wanting to sleep all day and be lazy and not post videos for a while, a long while. I probably took a month off at one point this year, maybe a couple weeks. Um, I just want to post 
uh, more genuine content. That's why I want to take a break sometime this year and just reflect and make something absolutely spectacular. And that's what I meant by this. Being, I, I did not feel like I was me. So, uh, yeah. I, tr I, I, I didn't phrase it right. <laughs> Alright, let's continue on. <laughs> just... My mind is just swinging everywhere, and, you know, positivity can change that, you know? Kindness, not hatefulness and bashing people and all that stuff that is on the internet somewhere. We just have to be a great person, a, a identity, a entity. A being, um, someone, a being, it doesn't matter who you are, race, gender, whatever, on the internet, you are a face, just a face. I don't know what this has to do with anything, but we have to be better people in the world. It's been a terrible year, this past year, you know, uh... Fire, forest fires, to Trump, to <laughs> Black Lives Matter, and all that stuff. I didn't say anything when that was happening, and I feel bad about it, you know. But I, I try not to get political on the channel, but uh, we gotta be better people this year, you know. We gotta be. I've already said it. Forgiveful, uh, forgiveful, forgiveness, kindness, and caring. That is the three factors of a good person, a good being, an alien, whatever you are in the world, on the internet, in space. Doesn't matter. But those three, caring, kindness, and forgiving, caring, kindness, and forgiving, I don't know what I just said, but those three factors are what we need to do this year. And uh, I am still going to make a movie. Make a movie. Get a job. Uh, build a new computer. <laughs> it's just so many... Uh, goals this year for me and I want to perfect 2021 to be something good because this is going to be my 21st birthday I'm going to be 21 years old that means I can you know drink and smoke weed legally in different in different states of America whatever but that doesn't matter to me we have to be good people good beings good aliens Whatever it is in the world, space, the universe. I'm being dramatic, but just believe me. Caring, kindness, and forgiving is what can save someone, you know? And, uh, I just, you guys are the super chillest people, family I've had in my life. And seven years, six to seven years, is insane, and we're not getting a lot of views, but hey, there is someone watching, always, alright? Just believe me. Now, if you want some merch, my grandma gave me this shirt for Christmas, she bought me my own merch, but... This is our 100k uh, merch. We're going on, I don't know how many subscribers I have anymore, but 250,000 plus subscribers, almost to 300k is uh, really insane. And I can't believe I'm like, like close to Joey's World Tour and subscribers. And it's only been like, Two years since I collab with him, almost. It'll be in two years in August. 
Now, I thank you all. You're amazing. I've said this many times. I hope you're 2020, but god dang it, 2021 is going to be spectacular. It is 3 in the morning. I hope I didn't wake up anyone. So, please, have a great day, and I will be back eventually with an actual cooking review or whatever I had planned in a couple of few days or weeks. Sometime in January. Alright, this is Orion, and I'm signing off for the next time in the Super Chill family on YouTube. Stay super chill.